Hey what's up guys, this is Wood Geek. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Epic Mickey. Here we are at Lonesome Manor. Or rather, the exterior of Lonesome Manor. Uh, this, as I've said in the past, is the haunted area of Epic Mickey. When you depress this platform, those islands rise up out of the thinner. Must be some part of an old ride. At least it will help us get across, eh? Alright, so what we gotta do here is... If we step off of this, what? The platform only works as long as something rests on it. So, you see this anvil right here? Neither did I. Just thin out this tree, the anvil will drop, and, perm and will permanently press down that switch so we can platform across this area. Let's get, get rid of these spladooshes before we do anything else. There we go. Cousin Alex lies beneath this ground. The specter behind him made no sound. The hell? There, There is a nun sh- Okay. That was weird. Poor Uncle Dwight was changing a light when he had a shocking idea. <laughs> no. Stop. I meant to jump. What are the- Hold on. Aww. What's this one say? Mr. Jones, master of the chase, challenged the reaper but lost the race. Tit. Well, he killed the spirits, so they can no longer be, uh, resting in peace. What's, what's this? Is this a gold, silver pen? It's a bronze pen. Probably should have tested some settings first before I started recording, because, uh, I was alt- I was, uh, changing around the- the uh, brightness and contrast of a day or so ago, and uh, I didn't test it before I started recording today. Uh, rest in peace, peace dear Uncle Nate. Who would have foreseen your twisted fate? Oh, he just spit out a silvery ticket. Is there something that? No, I'm just seeing things. Okay, here we are at the Lonesome Manor entrance. Oh, the Mad Doctor. Mickey, it's the Mad Doctor. Really. I've heard about you stumbling about in Wasteland. You will regret the day you found me, Mickey Mouse. As far as you'll get, my defenses will keep you out. Looks like you left something behind. What do you think it is? Gee, I don't know. What's this one say? Rolf was once here, but it is no more. The long armor, the law, even the score. The Brothers J, builders renowned, built the graveyard where they lay in the ground. Her rooftop rocker too close to the ledge deep, sent Deer Hunt Windy over the edge. That's pretty tragic. Ooh, gimme. Yeah. Alright. For this little bit, we gotta... Well, first, actually... We got... Whoa! Huh. It won't budge. We're gonna need something really heavy, Mickey. Anvil heavy. If that's not a hint as to what you gotta do, and if that note towards what the do Mad Doctor left behind wasn't a hint, either. Guess what we gotta do? Uh, misplace our jump because we can't see very well. That's what we gotta do. Alright, jump up here. Take a guess. Alright. Jump onto these. Uh, camera messing up. There we go. Uh, no secrets here. Oh, here's a secret, actually. That's a collectible. Lonesome Manor 2, is it? I can't see from here. Okay. Anything back here? Yes. A Splatoosh and a Gremlin. Oh, come on. Come on, come on. There we go. That Splatoosh should trap me in here. I was sure I was a goner. Here, take this anvil sketch. You saved my life. Try using the anvil on a beetle works for a crushing blow. Well, this is a weight off my mind. You found an anvil sketch. How many times have you said to yourself, What could I do right now with even one anvil? Remove opponents. Trigger pressure plates. Climb. Scroll through your sketches with the plus button. Use your sketches with the minus button. These sketches at least don't weigh anything. But the anvils, so... 
So now we have an anvil sketch. Swell. I wonder if those were sent to chase us off. So now we have an anvil sketches. We didn't have to rescue the gremlin to get those. We could have also come over here and open this chest. Bet he would have taken that chest, new item received, with him if you had scared him off. Yoink! Anvil sketches. Swing All right, so thankfully the cutscene doesn't play again. But we don't have to deal with these spatters. Okay, one down. Okay, another. Hey. Did not, also did not mean to uh, to use the uh, thinner that go for it. There we go. All right, let's switch to our anvil and plop it down. Bam! Nice work. That anvil jammed the button. Should keep the door open for good. Let's go. All right, now we got to enter lonesome hinner, but. To do that, we gotta go into. Where are you going? We gotta go into another portal. Are you sure you want to enter Lonesome Men or Foyer? Is it Foyer or Foyer? I don't know. Alrighty, this is the Mad Doctor Part 1, I believe it is. The Mad Doctor is a cartoon involving, well, obviously, the Mad Doctor and Mickey. Uh, the plot is that the Mad Doctor took Pluto from Mickey's house, and he's uh, going to experiment on him. You can actually unlock the Mad Doctor cartoon as an extra uh, in the extras menu for this game. So if you want to watch it, then you can go to the extras menu and watch it there once you've unlocked it. Uh, the Mad Doctor cartoon is easily one of the creepier Mickey cartoons of the early, of the early Mickey days, anyway. It's still cartoony as hell, but regardless, it's still creepy. I mean, hell, you've got, uh, genetic experimentation with the Mad Doctor experimenting on Pluto. And, yeah. Everything's just out to get Mickey. And it, overall turns out just to be a, uh, a nightmare for Mickey, but regardless. Yeah. I'm a wimp, I know. Okie dokie, and we're in. Welcome to the Haunted Mansion. Looks like a lots of pol poltergeists are loose in here. Including a ghost trapped in that bottle. Poor guy really wants out. The mad doc wasn't kidding when he said he'd set up defenses. That looks like the way to go, but how do we get there and open it up? Alright, let's go see if we can't help the ghost in the foyer. Oh, one of these guys again. Oh my god, another one take that and bam now I think this thing is just gonna keep spitting out so let's turn off the the eye I don't know if that helps anything the more of the platforms I can be depressed with an anvil wait when did, when did we get three? Oh, that's how because these beetle works just keep dropping am I right all right yep I'm right all right let's uh, put one down there Icky. Another one right... Oh, we got it. Right, step on it. Because it's got a cooldown. Hello? Who's there? Get me out of here, please! I got you! I got you, man! Ah, uh -huh, I can breathe again. That's just a figure of speech, you see. I don't really need oxygen. Uh, aren't you Mickey Mouse? Uh, how long was I in that bottle? Well, Mickey, let me show you a little secret I learned in my time here. The skull house restless spirit. Uh, these skulls house res restless spirits that would otherwise cause chaos here. But the spirits in them are only pacified when the skull is fully restored. So now we have an extra task of painting in the skulls. So the poltergeists would stop messing around. Is this thinner under here? 
Yeah. Kind of hard to see. Back here. Aha! One of the skulls. That's a lot of Spladooshes. Okay, let's paint you as well. And then... There we go. What's this? A silver pen? Silver pen. Now I just guessed there. Wait a minute. What kind of skull is that? Looks like... Looks kind of like one of the, uh... Like one of Horus's kind. Kind of like one of those horses, yeesh. That's pretty grim. Okay, paint that in. Okie doke. That takes care of that one. That's one skull. The spirits are free. Oh, the eyes are lighting up. Let's find the other skull. Okie doke. Haha. <laughs> that looked cool. And what's back here? There's a beetle works behind me. Yeep. Yoink. And you just gonna there we go. Next skull. That lowers that one. Meow. Wink. Now, I think if we left the... If we just left the things flying around, we could have platformed across them to get some more goodies. Come talk to me. He's lonely. What's this? Barrels of dynamite? What is this even? That was a stupid sweeper. What the... Did a Splodoosh explode? Possibly. Also, there's a siren going off in the background. Hope you can't hear that. Okay, you're, you definitely heard that. Again! Oh, can I glitch it? Glitched it. Doop bitty, dee dee bitty. Gotcha. Oh. Duh. <laughs> Where where'd you go? You're over here. Don't worry, man. I got you. You're not gonna be you're not gonna be worried. L lonesome. You're not gonna be a lonesome ghost anymore. Good show. Screeching sound. Thanks for all your help. Here's the way out. Well, I gotta take off. But here, have my treasure. You've earned it. Let me guess. It's another anvil sketch. And what? Yeah, it's another anvil sketch. That, or it was a TV or a watch sketch, I'm not sure. Either way, let's head up these stairs and get going. Go deeper into the lonesome manor. The haunted house. Are we already done with the lonesome ghosts uh, portals? This is the haunted house. Uh, well, at least from what I can tell, it said a haunted house, so... I don't know if this is back to the... No, this is the haunted house, because the Mad Doctor didn't take place in, like, a mansion. Oh, man. Bonsai Basher and, uh... And Shally are gonna be freaking out if, they, if they're watching this. There's a lot of spiders everywhere. How do I get up there? Oh, man! Okay, that was creepy. That door's gonna close on me, isn't it? Or open on me. No? Kind of expected it. What? No! Shoot! Whoa! Yee! Okay. Death, no! Ah! Uh oh. Tch. Oh man. 
He's coming back. Get up there! Man. If I did this around Halloween, people would be shitting themselves. Not really. And we're out. Into the Lonesome Manor stretching room. Uh, game. Why y'all black? Okay, that was weird. The Lonesome Manor stretching room. Yes, it is a reference to the Haunted Mansion's stretching room. See what I mean? Tip. The head's from the Haunted Mansion, the movie. I don't know if it was from the ride beforehand either. The paintings are the guardians of this place. We can only proceed through this room with their blessing. Don't worry, they let us through. I would go way back with them. Nope. They're just gonna get scrambled. What? Some poltergeists are scrambling the paintings. We have to put them back in order before we can pass through. Mickey, use the spin move on a section of a painting to spin it into the correct position. You gotta match them all. Well, we also gotta... move things around, too. We go into this one. When you spin the lowest cog, the ones above it turn as well. That complicates things. So if we spin this, we can come over here. Looks like this button will bring the room back down to the bottom. So if we put an anvil on it... Get up. Spin. These gears inset in the fl Wait. Yeah, these gears inset in the floor can be used to raise and lower the paintings. Raise, them, raise and thin them in different combinations to get different results. The mask gear in the center will activate them. Change combination paintings to thin... What? Oh, shut up. Uh... Ba -ba -ba. Paint that in. And spin it. Then we go up a floor. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's how we do it. So that one's in the middle. But I don't know if... Okay, that one's also in the middle, and that one needs to be changed. Probably should have stuck at the bottom uh, before I did this. Alright, let's... Um, Oh, right, that's what it does. The, the two paint, paintable gears uh, raise and lower them, respectively, depending on which one you've already spun. Okay, let's spin this one. That one needs to be in the middle. But then, there's that one, so that could be a bit of trouble. This one seems to be good, aside from the top, so... Where does this one go? Wait, is this paintable? Yes, it is. Uh, bad. Okay, that doesn't change anything. Uh, ugh. Back here. Anything of importance, maybe? Just another one of these switches. Wow, that actually hit me. Okay, now this puzzle did kind of confuse me, so I'm not too sure on how to do this. Mm. 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 Whatever. Oh, right, duh. Okay, move up to the second floor. See what we can't do in this one. I know I'm probably missing something really obvious in this puzzle. So yeah, not too good at it. Great, that's not gonna help us. I wonder what happened if I painted it. Okay, it's the wrong one. Whoa, 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 whoa! 
What was that? Looks like this button will bring the room back down to the bottom. Wait, what? Maybe... Wait. Okay, hold on. It brings the room back down to the bottom, right? So... Assuming... Okay. Unpaint that. We need to spin this one. And then let's... Actually, spin this, see if we can't get anything out of this. Okay, those go to the top. That needs to stay in the middle. This needs to go. Alright. Um, this was the dude with TNT. That needs to go down to the bottom. So, let's thin that. I really don't know about this puzzle. I just did it on a whim, I believe, when I first did it. Okay, spin this. Now oh, there's a gremlin here. Thank you, Mickey. I'll sort the paintings for you. I'm quite the artist myself. Wait, what? First, to align these images as originally. Wait. He fixes them. Never mind, I didn't do it on a whim. I found the gremlin. Okay. You know, why not? So, uh... How about that, um... That ability to do things well. Forget I said anything. What do you mean you're not distracted by it? Only a spatter is, apparently. It's two down. Let's get you. Damn it. Let's just leave. The Mad Doctor, part two. Alright, this is actually in the confines of the Mad Doctor's lab. So... Creepy. Yeah, these shadows. Alright, I forgot how to get to that film rail. I believe... Oh, right, there's a, there's a thing right here. Alright, film reel. Uh, one, light the thing, two, actually light it. Hmm. I can't hit the thing down there, can I? Oh, yes I can. Interesting. Oh! And since we already got the film reel, there's no real point in us coming up here, at least I don't think. Unless there's just extra content. Or health, you know. Yoink. All these conveyor belts, and there's the operating chair for Mickey. This is a reference to the, to the thing where it just fades out, and then he wakes up, and there's Pluto's uh, doghouse, and everything's all good. Ready to enter the library? I don't know if I'm ready to enter the library. The library is scary! Am I in the library yet? I can't tell. It doesn't look like a library. There are no books to be seen. Oh, wait, never mind. There are bookcases flying around. Well, uh, now that we've gotten to the library, might as well just end it here. Because we've already dragged this out for 20, 25 minutes. So hopefully you enjoyed this part. Don't know how you did. This is Woody Geek. I'll see you guys later.